<laughs> are you seriously gonna do that in front of me right now? What? Why are you even liking pictures of other hot guys on Instagram? This is Neve, and this is Laura. They just got married nine months after they had their baby Cleo. Oops. Oops. Honestly, they have no idea what they're doing. But whatever, they're in love. And, and we're, we're here, here to, to help. help. Anybody in a relationship in 2017 knows how difficult it is to manage social media. <laughs> Beth says, my boyfriend liked an Instagram photo of a friend of a friend. She's like posing on the beach, making a cute face, and she's in a bikini. I wouldn't care if it was a photo of a celeb in a bikini, but this seemed a little too close to home. When I called him out on it, he accused me of being clingy. Was I wrong for calling him out for liking some random girl's bikini photo? I mean, oof, you gotta be, okay. oof, this is. No, uh, everyone's explore page, the discover page is full of hot girls. And so you can't expect, I mean, you're just bombarded with these images. You can't expect that your boyfriend or girlfriend isn't gonna like see these pictures and like once in a while, tap, tap. It's not a big deal. It's it, not oh man, you, you say that. But how many times have you called me out for seeing that I've liked a picture? Yeah, because it's funny. It's yeah, not like I'm actually mad. I'm like, ooh, mm. did, you, did you like that, bud? But aren't you a little? No, I'm not mad. I mean, they're images. So is it okay for a guy to follow lots of beautiful hot models and babes on Instagram and like their photos constantly, even if they're in a relationship? No. Okay, so, but the real issue here is not so much that he liked a picture of a girl. It's right. that it's like a girl that he could kind of know. Like he, yeah. someone in his realm of possibilities. Right, so I think she's right to be a little suspicious. If you like a girl's photo and she doesn't have a ton of followers, you're liking it because you know she's gonna see that you liked it. Right. And that's a flirt. That's you saying like, Hi. It is. I like it your. Is. I like your butt. It is. I do. I change my position on this. If it's an insta babe, I, I think I agree with Beth. If it's an insta babe and she's getting millions of likes, right. she's not going to notice. You're just another plebeian. Right. Just. And it's just. And that to me feels like an acceptable and safe way for guys to feel like they're still sort of connected to other women, but in a meaningless way. Right. And guys, you got to be careful. No accidental finger taps because <laughs> one wrong like. <laughs> can lead to a world of pain. <laughs> right. Hi, this is Mina. Hi. All right, hey, what's up? How can we help? So, I've been seeing this guy I met off of Tinder for a few months now, and it's weird, but he won't add me to any of his social media pages. Like, I tried adding him on Facebook and Instagram after our third date, and it's been a few months since then. I brought it up as a joke once, and he kind of just, like, laughed it off awkwardly. Should I be worried? He's hiding something. I don't know. If you guys are dating, like, all the time, or is there a chance that he could still be seeing someone else? I, I mean, he's he's really sweet, and he's kind of alluded to the fact that I am the only girl that he's seeing, so I, I don't know. I'm kind of confused. I mean, I think you got to get in there. I think you gotta figure out what's happening. Have you guys been together and has he posted a photo to his Instagram? Um, I mean, not that I know of. I mean, like sometimes we'll like during dinners, um, he'll, you know, hop on his phone, I'll hop on mine. Huh. huh. No, no, you gotta figure this out. You should be building a case. Make another account. Yeah, you might need to catfish him. The catfish king. <laughs> is condoning, condoning catfishing. Cat All right, well, thank you guys so much. I'll definitely get to the bottom of this. All right, thanks, baby girl. See ya. All right, so we have an email from Raquel. Okay. My girlfriend is obsessed with making her life look perfect on Facebook and Instagram. Every single place we go, she takes like 100 pictures and has this pose and it's exhausting. And it's not enough for her to post the photos. She gets really offended when I don't. I'm like, why do I need to post any? You posted all of them. She says it hurts her feelings when she doesn't see the photos on my Facebook or Instagram page. I feel like she's obsessed with social media. Who's right? I think this happens a lot in all relationships. It does. It happens with us too. Like if we are both at something fun or if someone takes a great photo of us and texts it to us, then there's always like, who's posting? Who's you gonna, gonna post do it? Do you get to post it or should I post it? The girlfriend's obsessed with social media. Right. So she should just be obsessed with it and handle all of the social media pages for them both. Right, but where does that obsession start to get in the way of just being in a relationship? But there's also a reality that people in relationships want 
their partners to publicly display that they're in a happy, perfect yeah. relationship. I don't know, you're both, you should post a little more, she should whine a little less. Compromise.